So I recently started playing NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup for the first time in years, and the beginning got me thinking. If you've never played this game, or for those of you that haven't played it in a long time, I'll give you a little refresher. So when you start a new game, it goes to a cutscene where it shows your character sitting at a stoplight waiting for it to turn green, and none other than Ryan Newman, just a few years removed from his Rookie of the Year award, pulls up next to you and challenges you to a race. The race itself is pretty simple, it's just one lap around a fictional street circuit, and once you beat Ryan Newman, you're allowed to advance onto career or chase for the cup mode. And upon replaying this level, it got me thinking, has anyone ever tried to flip over Ryan Newman in this intro level? We're all aware of his extended relationship when it comes to cars getting airborne, upside down, or landing on top of his. So I thought it would be only fitting to try to get Ryan Newman to roll over in what's supposed to be just this normal, simple, introductory level. So without further ado, let's get started. Alright, so this seems like it might be simple on the surface, but keep in mind this is an arcade game. The flip physics aren't exactly super realistic, so this might have to take a few tries. Since there's no blowovers or weight shift rollovers, I don't think for any for anything like that. Gonna have to try to wedge him into a wall and hope something like that works, like this. Nope. Alright, keep trying. Let's try it the next turn. I think we're basically just gonna have to force him into a wall and hope that he flips over then. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, we got up on our side! He did a little bit too, but no luck yet. He won this one, we're just gonna restart. Alright, attempt number two to get Ryan Newman to flip in the opening level to NASCAR 2005 Chase for the Cup. Try to send him right into this wall. Let's do it. Oh! Oh, darn it! That was a no stand. I don't think that counted as a flip. That was so close. Almost got it on the second attempt. We're gonna have to try again. Where is he? He's right to the left of us. There he is. Oh no! We flipped! Wrong car. And once again, with our failed attempts, he escapes and gets the win, so we gotta retry. Alright, start of attempt number three. Our best attempt so far was hitting him up against this first wall right here, so let's try this again. Come on, come on. Oh, he got up on his side and looked like he was going to tip over, but he sat back down on all fours. You know you want to be upside down. You know you love it. Come on, come on. Oh, once again, up on his side. Yeah, another failed attempt. Another Ryan Newman victory. We're not going to catch him, so... Next attempt. Next! Alrighty, I think this is attempt number four. Hopefully I haven't already lost count. Alright, come on, Newman. You know you want to do it. You know you want it. Oh, darn it. Both of us into the wall again. Neither one flipped over. He's going to turn dead left when he starts turning right. Come on. Nope. I think that first turn is going to be our best bet. Ouch. Big wreck for me. Did he flip? Nope. Ah, oh, darn it. Alright, well, he didn't flip, but at least we'll get the victory this time. So, for once, we finished ahead of Ryan Newman, but we're going to have to try again for the rollover. Alright, attempt number five. This first turn has usually been the best bet. Oh! Oh! Nope. Close. Once again, I got got up on my side, and so did he, but this is way more difficult than I thought it would be. Alright, got a lot of speed going. Darn it. Alright, and he is off. We're not going to catch him, so we're going to just start attempt number six. Alright, here is the start of attempt number six. I think we need to do it on this first wall. This first turn has usually been our best bet. Come on, come on. Oh, did he did he flip? I can't see. I can't see. I don't think he did because he's driving away pretty quickly. I think he got up on his side. I think he got up on his side. And now he's driving away. 
Oh, darn it. I need to make sure I can actually see him in my field of view, too. If I can roll over. I'm not going to catch him. We're just going to start attempt number seven. All right, so here's attempt number seven. I think if we don't get it in this first turn, I'm just going to keep restarting. Because this first turn is our best bet. Nope. Big wreck for me. No upside down for Newman. Next. All right. Attempt number eight. Yes, attempt number eight. Same turn. Come on. Oh, 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 darn it. So close. I thought he was going to tip over. That, that wreck so defied the laws of physics right there. He was on his side going downhill, but then he still somehow went down on all fours. All right, another failed attempt, so next. All right, come on, Ryan. Please cooperate with me. I flipped over once again, but Newman didn't. No flip for Newman. Next. Right, come on. This is attempt... This is either attempt number 9 or 10. I think I'm starting to lose count. I think it's 9. Ouch. Hard wreck. Oh! We got him! He's upside down! Look at that! Bingo! Success! I have no idea how it happened that way, but he hit the wall and apparently flipped over. Yeah, darn it. We didn't see that impact because he wasn't directly in front of or behind us when he actually flipped over, but he flipped. There's no doubt about it. We saw in the rearview mirror, he was upside down. Now we just gotta win this race and rub it in his face. All right, final corner coming onto the straightaway and we are gonna get the victory over Ryan Newman. And look at that, upside down and everything. He still finished just a couple seconds behind me. And we get the victory and roll off into the sunset.